because I got I got this this like fine I got this fine girl. She's like she's like a ten. I gotta see her tomorrow. So I don't know if I'm gonna be able to make it in. Like I don't know if like you think you think they'll fire me if I give. That's like the reason. Or like. Um. Yeah. I would definitely either lie or yeah, you'll get fired because that's really not a good excuse. All right. For I, yeah. Because like. we're a church going family, and I just I don't I don't know about these like. Cause I, I was mad about him playing GTA the other day. Like he's in a strip club, naked girls. I, I'm I'm not I'm not very happy about that. But I'm, yeah. thank you for telling me. I, 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 would... I got I got this fishing thing, like this ice fishing thing I'm trying to do. But like, how 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 should I like get out of this? Like, should I lie to him or should I just tell him the truth? Like, what yeah. do you think? You want me to lie? Think you, you think I should lie? I think you should lie. All right, I'll just yeah. tell I'll just tell him that my mom fell on the stairs or something. Thank. You. All right, this is gonna be the worst vlogmas I put out, just because I dropped a banger yesterday, and if you didn't go, like I said, go check that out. Um, that was pretty good. It's also gonna be trash because Tavazza's in it. <laughs> What'd you say like that? <laughs> but we're just gonna have a, a talk. We're gonna have a mukbang without food. Actually, let me get a piece of gum. We gotta have a mukbang with gum. Yo, Regan, how are we gonna get this bread, bro? What do you guys wanna record? Should I do the prank call videos? <laughs> nah, let's do it. <laughs> yeah, I forgot about that. That's a good idea. Other departments, press eight. Hello, <clears throat> this is Regan. Please state your name. Uh, hi, this is Todd, and um, I'm just make I'm just checking to make sure if I still, cause tomorrow's supposed to be my first day. But like I don't know really what to do. Like um yeah, you come in and check in with the leader that's in your area. All right, cause I'm gonna be in electronics, I think. Yep. Yeah. You just you um you just uh get there and then ask someone for walkie and say um I'm looking for the electronics leader. Um, okay. And then yeah. What if, what if I'm not what, what if I'm not able to make it tomorrow? Like do I who do I talk to about that um if you're not able to come in um you got a call um before your shift um and either talk to hr or the leader of the area and let them know you can't make it all right because i got i got this this like fine i got this fine girl she's like she's like a 10 i gotta see her tomorrow so i don't know if i'm gonna be able to make it in like I don't know if like you think you think they'll fire me if I give that's like the reason, or like. Um. Yeah, I would definitely either lie or yeah, you'll get fired because that's really not a good excuse. All right. For uh, team members. Cause I don't want I don't want to say I'm sick because you know the whole coronavirus thing. Yeah. Like, they they'll think I'm sick and they don't they're not gonna want to hire me. Like they don't want they're not gonna want me to come in. They'll be like you got COVID. So. Um. Yeah. No, you can be sick for other reasons and and just call in. Uh, but yeah, uh, what was your name? I can just let the um, team lead know. Uh, just, Todd Johnson. They need to... Todd. Okay. All right. Yeah, I'll let them know um, that you um, just had a, a few questions and uh, might call tomorrow to um, ask. All right. So. All right. Thank you. I appreciate that. No problem. Have a good day. Much love. <laughs> 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 that was good though. What? That was good. I don't know, that was my first one too. Walmart. <laughs> what you guys say? Whatever comes to my mind. <laughs> That's what I did. I got this fine 10 piece. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta see her tomorrow. She was like, you should lie. Uh, hi, who is this? Oh uh, hi Pam. Um, this is Mark, and um, I'm not gonna be able to make it tomorrow morning. Okay, uh, so did you, did you call the wire? The wa no, I didn't. I, I didn't know which one to call, so I just I just clicked on um, zero. Okay, you called both actually, but if you can't get a hold of the manager, you have to make sure you call the wire because they can, it's computer. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Uh, yeah, I know what you're. So, is, it, is there like any way you could tell them that I'm not gonna be able to make it tomorrow? Do you want to talk to one of them? I can page them on the on the walkie. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, you, that's fine. But wait, but before before you page them, before you page them though, like, like, um, how do you think? Like, my, like, I'm trying to. I can't. I'm not gonna be able to make it because like, I got I got this fishing thing, like this ice fishing thing I'm trying to do. But like, 
how 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 should I like get out of this? Like, should I lie to him or should I just tell him the truth? Like, what yeah. do you think? You want me to lie? You, you think I should I think lie? You should lie. All right, I'll yeah. just tell I'll just tell him that my mom fell on the stairs or something. Thank you. We just like. Okay. Okay. All right. The best thing to do is just to call him over here and call him. All right. Yeah. Okay. And then, uh, okay. How many? Do you have any? Uh, anything against you? Like points for being absent at all? Yeah, I got a cup. Like, I went out drinking. You and get four and a half yeah. before you get canned. Oh. All right. So you just have to make sure. Do you have PTO? Any uh, PTO built up? Yeah. But, then you can take it off of that. Yeah, but I just, I just this ice fishing thing, just, I feel like it's okay, more important than work. Say, why don't you just tell them what you're done and just say this is what's going on and just say it's like you have to go. Just tell me you have to go because All right. just say you have to go. All right. <laughs> All right, thank you. Okay, or you know what? When, when is it? Oh, tomorrow? Yeah, tomorrow. You should have requested a day. You should have put in a, a request for a day off. Yeah. I, it was just like, it was just last minute and stuff. So. And there's like, there's going to be some girl. There's going to be some girl. There's going to be some. Yeah, you could. Yeah, you could. You give me the manager. Yeah, because it's just the first. What should I say? Give me something. <laughs> Why are you putting in that many buttons, bro? That's <laughs> Oh my God, yeah. This is gonna be like some girls in some bikinis, you know? Like it's only it's like. A... Alright, alright, I won't tell them that part. Alright. Okay. Thank you, Pam. Uh -huh. Alright. You about to You know, damn well that shit don't work for you. <clears throat> hello. Um, hello. How are you doing today? What's up? How you doing today? Pretty good. Oh, uh, that's good. That's good. Um, anyways, um, I have a uh, couple questions about the PS5. Sold out currently. Uh, last time we saw them was Black Friday, and they have literally not told us anything about when we're getting restocked. Really? Yeah. You don't need, like you don't know anything about like when they're gonna come in again. Sadly, like they just haven't been telling us anything. Do you guys have the PS4 Pro? Uh, not here, but we do have some at our South Point location. Do you guys do like trade-ins for the PS4 Pro or not? Yeah. Cause like I have like a couple like uh PSPs. I have like five of them, but I'm just trying to get rid of them. I was trying to see if I can trade like the PSPs for uh, the PS4 Pro. Um. Wait. So you're saying you want to? Trade in a PS4 Pro or? No, I want to trade in my PSPs for oh. my PS4 because I have like five yeah, of those. Yeah, we can't take PSPs right now. Why not? COVID. We're not allowed to take anything like under the current gens just for concerns. But um, I have um two Xboxes. Can that work out? Uh, as long as they're Xbox Ones, we can't take 360s. God damn it. <laughs> yeah. Why not? You can't do me a deal? I, same reason. <laughs> you can't do me a deal? Uh, sadly, no. We just can't do anything about it. I know uh, Gamers and Game Room, though, those two stores, they're still taking older, like, consoles and systems, so they might be able to help you out. You think they can take the P uh, five PS5s? I mean, five <laughs> PSPs? Uh, probably. I know they resell PSPs there, too. Really? You'd probably be able to. Oh. But um, I have one more question. Yeah. So like, let's say if I were to turn in my PSPs, like, how many points would I get? Uh, again, we don't take them. I fucked up. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> I fucked up. British Hollywood. Hey, how are you doing, This is Larry. How can I help you? Hi, Larry. Oh, I just got a quick question. Of course. Um, when I buy, when I pay for, well, you said. Buy, I was listening to the thing. You gotta buy games online, or can I go in there and I buy a game? Is that that's still fun, right? Yeah, a little bit. All right. All right. All right. Cause I'm I'm trying to get my son this game, uh, Cyberpunk. Like, do you like what is it? What is that game about? What is it about? Yeah, like what is the game about? Like my son's been asking me about this Cyberpunk. Sure. Well, this uh, doesn't come out until the tenth. Um, I do recommend definitely coming in and reserving it though, because I don't anticipate us having many extra. But, um, um say. Can say I pre order it over the phone? Sorry? 
No, you have to come in and put at least a five dollar deposit down All towards right. it, and then we guarantee it for you on launch day. All right. uh, but it's an open world first person shooter story based game where you're, um, you know, yeah. any decision you make changes the outcome of the story. Lots of customization options. It's you know action shooter. Yeah. It's kind of like the Witcher kind of meets like um, I'm not sure if you played like Deus Ex or. Well, this is this is for my this is for my seven year old son. So like, would you recommend this game for like him? Like, like would you would you let your seven year old son play this game? Well, obviously it's always subjective, but um, it is very mature, yeah, right. very very mature. So like, there's you, cursing would, and stuff. There's much more than that. It's very mature. I would I would actually if I were you look into it real quick, all right. just so you can see. All right. And online, I'll give you all the details. There's a lot you can see. I mean, it's a game that I'm sure many seven-year-olds would like to play, but every parent's different in terms of what they're comfortable their children yeah. playing. Yeah, because we're a church-going family, and I just I don't I don't know about these like because I, I was mad about him playing GTA the other day. Like he's in a strip club, naked girls. I, I'm I'm not I'm not very happy about that. But I'm, yeah, thank you for telling me. And I would I would, I would definitely not recommend Cyberpunk. All right. Based off of what I've seen, it's not out yet, but based off what I've do, you, do you recommend any other games? If you want. Yeah, there's plenty of games, all kinds of games. I mean, depends on your kid wants to get what they like, but there's all kinds of games. You want to come by, we can recommend all kinds of stuff and show you stuff. All right. Thank you, man. I appreciate it. I'll probably be there. What time do you guys close at? Today we close at 8. 8? All right. Yeah. I'll probably be there tomorrow then. You going to be there tomorrow, Larry? Um, For a little bit, yes. All right. I might I might, I might, might be there around like 2 or 3 tomorrow. All right. Sounds good. We'll see you tomorrow. Thanks, man. All right. Thanks, man. Appreciate it. Okay. Thanks, man. <laughs> should I call it GameStop, Walmart, or should I call it, um... I, said, I said, I got my... He, he, I walk in the room, he's playing GTA in the strip club. We're a joint family. <laughs> hello? Yeah, hello, guys. Alright, um, this is Keegan calling. Can you hear me? Yeah. Alright, hello. Um, I recently started working there last week. So, like, um, I'm supposed to come in tomorrow, but I can't make it tomorrow. Wait, 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 I have a question, can I ask you something real quick, before you speak to the manager? Yeah, what's up? Yo, what do you think, what should, what do you think I should tell him, because I'm not trying to tell him, like, I can't make it because of this thing I, I got going on. What do you think I should tell him? Should I tell him, like, um, I'm sick, should I tell him about coronavirus, or what should I tell him? Because I gotta go see this girl tomorrow that I met on Tinder. He said, I don't know, bro. <laughs> you don't know. Yeah, yeah. Yo, I'm dead. He said, I gotta go see this girl on Tinder. <laughs> All right. Last one, guys. Vlogmas 7. Period. Can you see me for how can I help you? Uh, who is this? Can you see me for? Yeah, but um, what's your name? I'm sorry. I said, what's your name? Manuela. Man, oh, all right, hi. <laughs> um, this is Thomas, and I start tomorrow, but I don't think I'm gonna be able to make it. Um, what time are you coming tomorrow? Uh, I don't even remember what time, but I know that I'm supposed to be there tomorrow, I think in the morning. Okay, and with who you speak? Who am I? Who am I? Who am I? Or you said, who do I speak to? Um, let me take your number. All right. Is it Thomas, your name? Yeah, my name is Thomas Mann. Okay. And um, I'm not gonna be able to make it because, because my mom has a stupid funeral thing for my, for my dad, but I don't really wanna go to it, but I have to. Okay, so... Give me your number and I I call the the manager. You can't. Well, before you tell the manager, before you talk to the manager, um, you can't you can't like help me out with this. Like, what should I do? Okay. Like, what should I what should I say to them? Should I just tell them the truth or should I just lie to them? Okay. So, what's your number? <laughs> it's hard. Piss me off. Anyways. No, I'm recording. It is recording. All right, guys, we're gonna do two more calls, and then this is it.
Uh, this is Frank, and I'm stuck in one of the freezers. Uh, could you send someone to come help me out? Um, I can send it to um, our manager, and he can help you with that. I don't know what that is. No, I'm I'm in the freezer, like in the in the meat and the deli. Okay, I'll send from me too. Uh, you, wait. Are you here now? Yeah, I'm in the freezer. Um, it's Frank. Oh, yeah, it's yeah, I'm stuck in it. It's like I don't know if it's the door's frozen. Like you don't hear me. I'm hitting against. I'm like the. the okay, I'll call, I'll call them right now. Let them to let you out. All right. Thank. Thank you. Yep. <laughs> he hung up. <laughs> He's, no, I don't know what that is. He's not gonna call you. He's not, He's not gonna, gonna call. He's not gonna call. <laughs> He's not gonna. She knows it's a prank. She's not what gonna should I call? Him. I said this is Frank. Bro, we're gonna do a part two though. It's gonna be much better. We just did this last minute. Like I said, I didn't even know what we were doing for vlogmas. Facts, sweet and all, just came okay. up. But it's gonna be much. You want you want to talk to her? Or you want me to? You do it. All right, I'll nah, do it. I'm drunk. Okay. She's gonna be so mad. She picks up. Hello. Hi. Um. Hi, Miss Payne. This is D Love. Yes. Um. I'm with T right now, and she's drunk. Like, what do you want me to do with her? Bring her home. Bring her home. Yes. I mean, you want? I mean, I could, I could bring her to my house until she's um gets from being undrunk, then I can bring her home after. No, just bring her home now. But I like, I'm in Lemister. Like, I don't really want to drive all the way to Fitchburg. You picked my child up from Fitchburg. You bring her where you picked her up from. Yeah, but it's kind of dark outside, and I can't really see I'm at sorry. night. I cannot help you there. You drop her off where you picked her up from. No, yeah, yeah. <laughs> she hung up. <laughs> she, she, hung, she hung up. She hung up. Yeah, see, Tara, it's a joke. Where she hates me forever. <laughs> He's not gonna hate you. Give she, it. Let me, let me call him. <laughs> <laughs> I said, I really don't feel like driving. It's dark out. She said, oh, hell no, yeah, yeah bring it. Fuck. Your mom she did not him. play that. Guys, that's been it. That, that's, been, again. that's Vlogman 7. Um, Period. I hope you guys this enjoyed this Vlogman seven. 7. I hope you, we, gonna, we, gonna come with, we got way better heat. We got way better heat. Regan, I, me and Regan going to cook up something for you guys. Regan going to start YouTube soon. Yeah. Anyways. We'll see. It's been ICD Lab, though. D Lab. <clears throat> Make sure you go check out all my videos. Yeah. I'm gonna leave their ads in the description yeah. uh, for Instagram and stuff. I don't use Anyways, we out. Love Bye. you. Yo, follow my OnlyFans. I think, I think you are, you are something special. Mm. I take you on a shopping street, yeah, yeah. Cause I'm so into you, girl. I'm so into you. I love you, baby. I'm so into you, girl. I'm so into you, oh, baby. What you like, what you like. Um. The reason why today's video is weak is because um because I, I dropped a banger yesterday. So if you didn't go listen to that to that song to that Ice by D Love. Oh my food! No. Alright, can we start eating? I'm okay, D Love. When you see this, we love you so much, right, Regan? Hmm? We love him so much. Mm -hmm. And don't forget to. Like and subscribe and put on the no um notification thing. So make sure the bell is on. Cat. Cat. Okay, bye guys.